Hello there and welcome to the Tauntaun Squadron YouTube channel. We are live. This is a Group B game. Uh, quite a few games going off right now in the XTC of 2021. My name is Sith Holocron. I'm from Belfast, Ireland, and um, I'm delighted to be bringing you this Group B game between Iceland and the Ukraine. It is a scum-off. It is a scum and villainy hatred match. Uh, it's Andre Balvinson against uh, Andre Gorbanov uh, from the Ukraine. Iceland on the left, Ukraine on the right, and uh, the initiative has went, as you can see, top left to Iceland. So they are in the middle of uh, setting down their obstacles and um, things looking kind of good all over i think so um let me see what we can do with tonight's stream so uh welcome welcome if there's anybody here uh, i have a whole one viewer hello i hope you're well good stuff so um ukraine are currently zero three haven't won a set so far iceland won two and still in with a bit of a chance if they make everything a win from here on so uh, group b still open um that is definitely a thing to remember so um why don't we try and see where we are with the list so let us start seeing as the uh, rocks are all down and they are all rocks including the tiniest little rock in x-wing 2.0 uh, which is the one that normally people hit. So let me show you what we have got going for Andre Balvinson from Iceland. So as you can hopefully see on your screen, um, Bosk in the Jumpmaster, uh, which is a, a lovely ship, a really, really nice ship. Uh, on that, he gets his free jamming beam. He takes the... Uh, Punishing one, which uh, replaces a crew with a droid, and he has R5P8. That means uh, you can re-roll as long as he's in arc. You get to re-roll three times with the three charges, but if you roll a crit, you have to suffer a critical damage as well. Little bit scary, but these are scum players. They don't care. He has a tank. In fact, he has three tanks. So Dengar at initiative six, we then go down to the very scary looking Bosk. And uh, Bosk is uh, really scary. So let's bring up all Bosk stuff. Initiative 4. Again, another jamming beam. I can't really see these being used that much. Forlom, which will give you two ions, which will do nothing to a big ship at all. Um, and it's a bit horrible. Zam for that really crucial crew slot for a return fire. She starts with her two charges turned down, but you can fire back. And Grado, so you can call crits, because as you can see on your screen, when you perform a primary attack after the neutralized result step, you can spend one crit result and turn it into two hits. And then this wonderful lady, also at initiative four. Um, God, I absolutely love Lancers. Uh, Protector Gleb and the title. Uh, entitled really quite good for just a point uh, so there could be an awful lot of um, tractor beams and things going on big huge tanks loving everything on that side of the table really do i think that's kind of cool and groovy and uh, let's go to the other side of the board they are still setting up so i may as well go through what i have up here so we'll get rid of uh, the Assage stuff. Let's get rid of all of that. And then let's just grab either one because they're all the same. They are four Skull Squadron pilots, all with Fearless. And Fearless Fangs are just absolutely abhorrent. They are just horrible. Uh, the whole thing of when you perform a primary attack, if the attack is range one and you're in a defender's firing arc, you may change one of your results, anything at all, to hit and then Concordia face off while you defend if the attack is in range one and you're in the attacker's fire arc, you change one result to a blank. So there we go. That is exactly what we have got going on right now. 
So they are now going to see what they can actually do, uh, which is pretty good, I would say. Um, it will not be long before they are all off to kind of be cool and nice and play their first game. Now, there's other Iceland Ukraine games starting right now. So it's game one or two or three at the minute. Not too sure where we are with anything yet. Uh, I would assume some of the other games have maybe started. Um, and that uh, interesting bangs in the far top right hand corner. Asajj, her uh, arc straight same with Dengar and that uh, Bosk will be in at the back just completely chilling out so they uh, need to set their dials problem is it does not appear that um, Ukraine have actually set a dial onto the ships yet um, as you can see on the right hand side of your screen um, there's no names on the dials <laughs> so um, while he sets the uh, these two uh, great named. So, you know, it really is a scum off. And Andre and Andrej, uh, it's very, very similar. Um, if I'm mispronouncing these names, please, chat, kick my ass, because that's not good if I'm getting them wrong. I assume now that he may have seen uh, that his dials are not actually set, they're just coloured. So he's probably going to turn them over. XTC 2021 rules are that uh, the clock does not go until all dies have been set. So uh, interesting. Interesting indeed that he has completely forgotten to um, assign his dials to the ships. So we may be here for a little while longer. But I may just ping them and uh, let them know that they're not actually assigned yet. So, um, let us discuss where the rocks are, uh, the whole turn zero thing. I genuinely do like uh, where, okay, so apparently we are set. I'm not so sure that is a thing, but there we go. So, let's start the clock then, and off we go. So, uh, Banks in, turns in. Asajj, a five straight. Unbelievable that that huge big ship can do five. It's a large base. It disappears halfway down the map almost. Imagine if that had a boost. Dear God, that would just be absolutely terrible. Uh, so, let us see where we are at. So, his, his dials are fine. Okie dokie, that's, that's fine. Um, so, Red Skull. Uh, I can assume that all these uh, are going to go for the joust. Um, we white turns to the left and a bit of a boost and then they'll be flipped over and all will be well in the world. So uh, I don't know what the weather is like uh, for you, but uh, it's actually not the nicest weather in Ireland at the minute. It has been beautiful all day and it has now decided to be very much like rain. So we'll have to see where we are at. So precious little, um, as always, in the first uh, movement phase. Um, I will assume that the Ukrainian player will want to get these fangs into range one as close as humanly possible. Probably try and get an engagement maybe through um, that line there. So there's a lovely corridor if they were to all to sort of bank uh, three to the right. You might be able to get a two engagement uh, at range three, which is highly possible. Um, be very, very interesting indeed to see where um, Andre from Iceland ends up with these. Will there be a flank from Massage? Will Dengar try and get in there and do some cool damage? There's an awful lot of very, very good stuff. Hello, Dodo, in chat. Hello, sir. It's uh, always good to have you here. There's a lot. It's another Germany game you could be watching instead of this fantastic giants from beyond the wall uh, of Iceland up against the, the whole beautiful, mighty Ukrainians. 
I, I'm really excited to be streaming this one. I think this has got the ability to be quite a quick game, or it will go to time. And I know that sounds terrible, but at the same stage, um, I think we're doing okay, to be fair. So let's see where we're at. In the game, it looks like everybody has now set their dials. Everybody has. Initiative with Iceland on the left. So they will move first. And I will assume that uh, Assange will um, maybe just go straight. Could be banks in from Bosk and Dengar. But um, uh, Dengar is range. Uh, he's i6 the other two are i4s so uh, bosk and asaj will be moving first dengar will go last that's um horrendous 180 degree big base all three just giant hull and shield of tanks up against the best style probably in the game with a built-in thing that is bordering on broken and then fearless making a double broken we have got a lot to get going in this match so um good luck to uh both countries and both players right across the board um the xtc has been fantastic we are now in week four so out of the seven weeks that we've got we are bang straight in the middle and i think the players are getting ready to go now and here we go so a one forward there from bosk uh, it takes a focus Will Asajj continue her fives? Absolutely. Overdrives. It's almost like she is going uh, off into hyperspace all by herself. This now allows the I4 skulls to move slowly or quickly. And, um, Good evening, Simon. Hello, sir. I, uh, one, one second. Let me jump into uh, Discord. Uh, we have a co-commentator. How wonderful. Let me bring in uh, the wonderful Connor Holmes from Team Ireland. Hello, sir. How are you? Good. How are you? I am not so bad. Um, I will uh, give you the uh, password and stuff in 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 Discord. I will I will give you that right now. Are we live? We are live, sir. We I am I am actually covering Iceland versus um Ukraine right oh, now. I, I know you I know you are the time delay, but I didn't know it was time. Oh no 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 we, we are actually live. So uh there you go, sir. That is the password. Uh please come on in if you wish to join me. More than welcome. If you don't mind. Absolutely I'll go not. Absolutely not. This is um, a right big scum off. This. It's a very different scum off, though, isn't it? It is. But I like I like this. Tanks versus agiles. That's that's all good. Right? <sighs> I I think it's all good. That's I that's have... all I can say. I have very mixed views on things. I really do. Well, uh, when you come in, um. If you take the top of the screen uh, being where the initiative token is, uh, the Fang started off in the top right-hand corner, one harder to the left, and then did two forwards. Asajj went five forward twice uh, and is looking quite nice at the bottom of the screen. Um, and then wow. ones from Bosk and all that sort of stuff, and we are now in the third bit of the movement phase. So... I cannot find your game, sir. What's it called? Uh, it's, 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 it's that. It's that, and that is the other thing as well. So no, it is that, it's and that is... As, it's not coming up as existing. Well, um, it is, because I'm in it. Um, well, that is also true. That, that, that is also true, uh, because that is... Just let me double-check that that is the right thing I gave you... Let me find what I'm looking for. Yeah, oh, it's uh, it's um, not take a take a one off that and make it around round century. There we go, and you'd get it eventually. Okay, gotcha. So, 
uh, greetings to the 10 people uh, who are here. Um, I am afraid, although I can read your English, of Ukrainian is fearless because they are, skulls are class. I have absolutely no idea what your name is. You're not fluent in Russian, are you, are you Connor? Uh, unfortunately not. I'm sending you a PM. Excellent. Because the, the password is incorrect for that. No, name. no, 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 no. It, 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 is, it is this. 100% it is this. I've just checked it. Weird. That is what it is. That is what it is. It is capitals, remember? So. I do not believe it. Oh, okay. Fuck it. We'll try it again. Whatever. Yeah, try it again. So, try it again. It's, it, it's, it's the same. So, um, we were, I will commentate while you, while you try and come in and you'll be, and there hey, you yeah, are. Yeah, yeah. Excellent. 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 I will, uh, type in to the chat, uh, to the players to let them know that, uh, there we go. So they, uh, they now don't think that you're some randomer coming in to flip the table or anything silly like that. So uh, we are in this position already, and I quite like where Iceland are have got their stuff. So um, I assume that, that these things all try and initially get a range three, uh, so they'll get their four uh, defense and then maybe rush a ship and then split, take a couple of turns back and try and half one of these things. A couple of range one shots from all four sounds pretty good to me. So uh, Iceland is built a fairly strange formulation of this. So they can have Asajj, Bosk, and Dengar. Dengar is well, he's not wearing enough for the beach. He's he, he's a bit naked. He is actually a little bit naked. So um, Bosk is back to something close to the original four long Greedo build, but. Yep. With the attached the Zan Wessel, which is now stapled onto some list far and wide. Uh, probably the best crew in the game. And I, I actually quite like the Asajj with uh, the Shadowcaster and Gleb. I think that's kind of good to be able to get all your uh, coordinate and all that sort of stuff. I'm not kind of sure ideas. I fully understand the Gleb, but it's not super expensive. It's the Shadowcaster just turns Asajj into a... Very Tractor heavy beam. hitting, yes. relatively decently dialed ship that can also do relatively interesting things as well. True. So, so uh, that, that's why like, like, I have a mixed comment about Fang, because it's a conversation we had the other day. Fangs are not interceptors. No, they're not. So, so Fang's dial is good, it's not great, and they have a reposition. But they have a very, very subjective reposition. Very. You can do one or the other, and you can get focus, and then you can stress, and you can be remarkably predictable. Yeah. Now, obviously, in range one, they get the massive advantage, but I think, I mean, it's in, I think Bosk is going to chew them up and spit them out. I can genuinely see that. I mean, if you look at this, it's well over 30 hull um, for Iceland. Um, I love that they're, you know, they both picked uh, Scum, and their names are practically the same. I think that is wonderful. Uh, that is just fantastic, seeing as we have Andre Balvinson on uh, from Iceland and Andreas Gorbanov from Ukraine. So uh, we're getting shots oh, this cool. turn. <laughs> so we are um, not so even. Fangs, fangs fly in and get, I think, a single range one shot, maybe two. I think it's one. one I range think one it's shot. One. I think it's one. So, so immediately, Iceland target, well, they don't have a target priority. Dengar has one shot. Yeah. And so, Dengar is oh, because we have a punishing one, Dengar. We have a punishing one, Dengar, with with the droid. Uh, that's not great. Um, that's uh, three dice got an eye. Uh, will still two hits though, but two uh, range three, four. four green. Chances are nothing, and nothing happens. He's still got lucky with the dice knocking a dice there. Losing the focus at this point might have been awfully dangerous if that is a range three frisage. Might be. And I think it is. Yeah, it is. Okay, so there's no range one shots this time. No, well, and mind, that, that is not where fangs want to be. <laughs> that is not where fangs want to be at all. So three die here from Asajj into red. Uh, dice go in the air, and three hits. That's, I, I like it. 
I like it. Oh, it should be one onto the... Oh, oh, nice roll. No. Spend your focus and pray Bosk doesn't shred you. Perfect. Absolutely no damage. Two shots and only one ship left to fire. That is going to be Bosk. And Bosk is going to go obstructed into the tokenless red. Obstructed range three with Greedo. Any shot that lands haps a fang. Pretty much. There is a crit. There is the Greedo crit. Another crit. And then uh, range three, through a rock. Five dice back. Yeah, we should. Oh, Lord. There's the crit. So, so the crit, crit goes gets... in, and the crit will load out Bosk split into two pits. And red. An auto direct hit. Very sadly, red goes down 2 2, and that is 25 points because each of one of these are 50. So it's going to be easy keeping score um, for Iceland. That's going to be nice and easy. Now, here's the bad thing here comes 12 red. And who would you go for? A south? <laughs> Single modified. Oof. Massage, right? Oof. Uh, He's got all the shots of the size. Hit, hit, so. crit. Nadi to evades. A uh, one shield. Oh, now, we're going to put a Sage has an evade in two fours here. Yep. So just the shield into a Sage. So this is, this is going to be zero. Uh, yeah. Spend the force. Spend the force. Zero. That is 50% of the Ukrainian firepower going in. So hit crit cancelled off by using the force. But there is still Lose blue and green. green. That's a beautiful hit. Natty. Natty's. Three hits. It is likely to be one. On average, it should be. Yeah. It, it is going to be one. Spend the force. Spend the event. Take one. Yep. So the final shield off on Asajj Vendras, and the last shot. And then probably we're going to get 2-3 on green. So yeah, not a bad turn for you, green. Not bad at all. Let's see what uh, this one actually does. Don't blank out or anything horrible. Oh, uh, no. Just a crit. Just a crit. And the event, no, no. and that is all she wrote for the first turn of engagement, and I now do not like where the fangs are that much. It, it could be worse. Uh, now I ask what are the fangs going to do, and the short answer is they're going to get crucified. It, well, we, we don't know. It is a dice game. Who, who genuinely does know? Um, let me uh, clean up that box. Well, green and blue have nowhere to go. Green uh, and red, sorry, have nowhere to go. Yes, the the initial ones from the front, seeing as Iceland moves first, uh, this could be a bumperino time altogether. I would assume, I will assume, I could be completely wrong, but I would like to probably see um, Bosk just do a little one forward uh, and set himself up uh, for the next turn. Uh, bear away, sorry. That's okay, sir. A Concordia. drink of water would okay. be excellent. Yeah, Concordia will be live yeah. and Fearless will be live if they're all at range one. But, but probably no more. But, but Concordia only works on your front quarter. So shooting at the side with Bosk does not trigger. I think we could see Bosk going through a little bit faster to get the side arc shot at range one. Yeah. Which will be fine killing. Oh, that will that will probably take at least well whatever one is closest. Um, I think God has he set his dials already. The Iceland guy definitely uh, knows exactly where he wants to put his ships, and he has the initiative. So his Asajj and uh, Bosk will move first. I, I quite like the the um, the Dengar build without any ordnance like so there's no missiles there's no torpedo there's absolutely nothing and i quite like there's no auto blasters though i know and i i, I mean, miss yeah, all you're, 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 you're slamming massage inside the size is good a oh, massage is fantastic absolutely fantastic so uh, after the boosts in the last movement round all the fangs are stressed and uh, asajj has got one force after having to use it to keep herself 
alive. I had to use both, but gets one back as it recurs. Um, hey, alive, I say remarkably healthy. Oh, oh, just losing two shields from from twelve red dice. That's pretty good right. going. I really She's love Lancers. At the end of this turn, though. No, she'll be probably smoking a wee bit by the end of this turn. Um, we shall just have to wait and see. W would you use this as, really, as the block? It's not going to be particularly easy to do it. Um, Dengar takes red off the board. You're in a much better spot. I'm trying to work out, unless you try to work my fine moves out here. I'm trying to work out Asajj. Because if Asajj banks in and just immediately blocks, red can hurt. No, he can't. No, Maybe red can't. He can two bank. He can two bank right. Yep. Which is exactly what's happened, okay? So, you've now got a few options, because red can two bank right. And hopefully has dial. If he's hard to right, he's sitting on a rock. Yeah. Green can shoot right past. Blue, I think, can manage a hard to right. Oh, there you go. One forward, you called it. Yep. But I'm not sure I super agree with that. Well, he's setting himself up for that turn in next turn round. Exactly, and and depending if there's a massive big thing here, he could just do one bank to the right as well, and and just absolutely slaughter them if he hasn't got an awful lot of damage in here. Love for a Sage to end up, and this is going uh, to be oh, this is going to be horrible. Well, he's just going to get the two range monster. I think the self bumping is is not a bad. No, no, I think that's I think that's pretty good. Dolls jump past, and I'm going to say Red's going to two back to the right, which is why I wasn't super convinced I like this Asajj play. There's Ooh, the two back to the right. So there you go. That's not so bad at all. Will that block any move from Bosk apart from the one forward? Very well, probable. Well, assume you mean Dengar. Yes. And in fairness, Dengar will not be objecting to a bump here. Absolutely not at all. Uh, the... And in fact, and in fact, red knows that. Uh, <laughs> That's right. So, uh, uh, barrel roll to the left for a focus and the uh, stress. And oh, dear uh, God, was, dear God, that didn't well Ukraine. That was that was beautiful. Fantastic flying uh, from Ukraine. Wonderful. Uh, except now you're going to take a huge. Now you got to take red off, right? You have to take. Well, red let's off. be honest. Red, red, is red is going to have a focus Concordia. So your, your big shot into there is auto evading one. True. I think you still probably uh, to take that shot. Yeah. Yeah. Well, I don't believe the other is to back. accept is to accept you're just going to get pummeled, Dengar, and take shots at the guys without focuses. That'd be interesting. Well, you can yes, take shot can... Bosk, Asajj, and Dengar to the same shot. Yep. Uh, personally speaking, yellow should be the choice if he's going to do that, and that is what they are going to do. So here comes a three die shot from. For the record, I shot red here all day. I would have tried to take red off. Uh, I like I re like reducing the amount of percentage of shots that are coming in uh, to here. That's not the best roll with just two eyes. Well, it's still Dengar, he's running RCP fifty-eight or R five P eight, whatever it is. Yep. So he re rolls one, spends a focus. He might get his three yet. Yeah. Only problem with this is if he goes a crit, doesn't. There you go. Doesn't. So spend yeah. that focus. You absolutely, absolutely have to. Uh, three hits. The uh, focus token. And he's used. forgot to spend the. F he's forgot to spend. <laughs> One, two, three, Nettys. What disrespect? What utter disrespect? Oh. So uh, this oh this could hurt. To be fair. Oh. Uh, Unmodify. Unmodified, we got to take a focus. Did she take a focus? What'd she do? She, I she believe, she took a focus. I believe she took a focus. Uh, if I oh, hope for Iceland, uh, they did. Uh, will it is such neglect to take an action. Uh, she took an evade last turn, but uh, from what I can see, maybe that's it. So, did not take an action. And there you go. That's that's wouldn't really have mattered that much anyway with Concordia. So well, range two from yeah, the big if man. You done it my way. If you done it my way, you'd be range one, and he would have Concordia. Oh, oh dear. Uh, so puts that to a crit. Three dice. Oh. 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 
it's not range one, so it's range two. It's, it's range two. It's two hits. So My two apologies. hits into yellow. And that is 50 to zero so far. Just just like that. That's all. Take a deep breath, brace yourself for the next two seconds. This may hurt Iceland. So, um. Not the shot I would take first. I would have taken red to see what he did to that guard. Yes. Uh, okay. We're just going to take the shot in front of us. So, hit, hit, crit. That's fearless. Fearless for uh, three uh, hits and a crit. Natural evades. <laughs> Natural evades from Iceland. So hit crit onto uh that is Asajj it's going into, I assume. Well the uh, Ukrainians decided they don't care about this, they're gonna split fire, just do the maximum shot. So I've gotta assume if you do you shoot Dengar here it's just weird, so it's gotta be Asajj again. And it's it's three. Three, absolutely. There's the roll back. Um, two another, more again. Two so another damage going into Asajj, trying desperately to get this big ship down. It should be down to five hull, if I might. Can you see what the um, oh, yeah, crit you're, was? You're right. The okay, crit say console fire. Console fire. Disaster so, for big ships. Asajj has rolled six green dice. In the, sorry, in the last... No, he's not. He's rolled ten green dice? Yes. Twelve? And he's had eight, nine, ten, oh, eight. good God! Oh, this is why oh. fans with fearless are my. That's there's another, there's another two dice bot central. This <laughs> is unbelievable dice rolling. So, um, <laughs> my God! So two shields there. Here is. Three hits and a crit. Well, I'm telling you, these guys are absolutely not messing around. And this is the return shot from Dengar, isn't it? Yes, it is. So let me see where that has gone from. So it is going to be That's a crit. Red. It's a direct it's, hit. It's red. And red is dead. So what madness all this has turned into. Uh, two shields into Dengar. The skull is gone, which is terrifying to me that that is just out of there already that is now because of the half on yellow 75 points to mr bolfinson from iceland and mr gordobanov after doing quite a bit of damage there um but andre from iceland rolling more evades than i've ever seen in a game ever uh he scored 36 are we still live oh don't do not do not do this to me. Yes. Yes, we are. Yeah, we are live. Okay. It's just, uh, it's really far behind and the clock's not ticking on the screen. Ooh. Is it 53.34? Oh, it's now it's 51.42. It may be buffering. So, a uh, good amount of shooting going on in there. Um, things seem to be uh, relatively oh, okay. Keep going. Is still going. Yeah, we're still so, going. Um, Not good if you lose a fine. Um, that just reduces the amount of red dice that uh, these guys can fire. I can move all of that off the screen. I think target priorities are mapping. A little odd, but he got away with it with the Dengar response. Yeah, absolutely. Um, I would have probably went for red first, same as yourself. You, you need these fangs, especially when they're right up close and personal. You need to be able to take them out. They are only four hull. As you can see, it doesn't take an awful lot for them to explode quite badly. Uh, Green is in a horrible position now. He's got a great dial. He's not stressed. Everything is fine. Um... And if he does it like a too hard to the right, he probably won't be getting shot by Dengar unless Dengar moves his turret. Where do you think Asajj goes, my friends? Uh, have a look 
the chat. I, I am. So. I am. There's very, very little we can do about the lag. This uh, this server is actually in the Ukraine. So. Um, oh, well, really? The YouTube is? Uh, no, uh, th this TTS server is actually in the eastern side of Russia. Yes. So it's kind of coming from quite a, quite a bit away. But uh, my ping 75. So I don't quite understand what's going on. Uh, apologies yeah, if it is lagging. Definitely not the t it's definitely not the TTS. No. So I think I uh, need to get in contact with my internet provider and uh, maybe not stream. So Chris is saying it's okay. it seems okay, fine. Now they are about 30 to 90 seconds behind us anyway. So hopefully it'll 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 get it'll get better as it goes on. So I'm just going to try and see if I can while they're doing their uh their dials, I'm just gonna jump into OBS and see what is going on. Alright, well let's discuss what the options are. Go for it. Fangs are not in a vulnerable position. Green by not bumping. Realistically is restricted to the one hard right. Um you should be able to get a side shot on Dengar, I believe. Yep. Yep. Uh Saj is going to do a 4K. Inferno was well, a good call that. And she's on that. Yep. Ask. Thanks. Okay. Confident that R2 will not take off the table. I am. Um... <laughs> I would be a little worried about him. But no, nope, should be fine. Should be fine. There's the hard one for green. Yep. Will, problem is will there be a barrel roll to try roll and get can... shots in? Or will he just he escape? I take the focus and not stress. You need your options next turn. Yeah. He listens to me, apparently. Two straight. There's the bump on the Dengar, which gives Green the, the flank shot. Yep. Which is absolutely perfect because. Problem is, you're now range one of Bosk as you're out of Concordia. Oh, lovely. Uh, one hard earth and blue, so. Another focus. There's going to be a bump gonna, here. This is not going to be. A, this is not going to be a great turn for you. I, 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 probably not. No. So there was the. Uh, tried to do a three bank to the left. Um, failed miserably. But uh, now he's got a range. Well, he would have failed. Loop. He would have failed my heading boss anyway. So I assume he knew he was going anywhere. Yep. So uh, here come the dice. Uh, four into three. Oh. Four into three. Cordia and focus active. Yep. And the only modification is the last charge in R five P eight. Yep. And that's just Which means Eh, I wouldn't use it. <laughs> so a crit and an eye, it's rolled. I I don't quite know where did the where did that hit come from? It uh, matters not it a judge matter. because yeah. of Concordia yeah. matters no judge required. None. Uh, range two into blue from Assange, so three v three. No Concordia this time, though. No, straight for a three v three, and then you get to decide what you're doing, Bosk. But Bosk is sure. Well, Bosk, if he understands how Concordia works, Bosk is shooting yellow. Oh, he knows how it works because he's shooting yellow now. Is. Uh, that's gonna be a four expenditure. Yep. So four dice. Is it is it blue or is it yellow? It, it'll be in the be in the yellow, uh, blue, won't it? Surely. Well, I put a shot yellow on the basis that then I would have shot at Bosk, but no, doesn't matter. He very much gets rewarded with a hit crit and then do a pilot. So Bosk is now going to have to shoot blue, Absolutely. Uh, and he will get his envelope made. Uh, was that both there, or? Or was it just the crit? No, nope, I can no, see. It was I can see crit. the two. Uh, perfecto. Oh, he's Set gone into yellow. This, uh, gentlemen, these guys are splitting fire in every string of shots. So, okay, he's gonna shoot yellow. He's got the range two. He's range one. But he's not getting Cordia. No, that's uh, not very good. Grado for the yeah. hit. I can't see this going through. Three greens well, should give you at least one. No, he's got 
Oh, yeah. Yep, not a mission. Oh, he has a good crew. Yellow. I'm so confused. No. Nope. Anyway, oh, I'm priority. confused about the target priority mount, if you want the truth. Here is a range one shot into the rear of the jump master. So um, this could hurt. It's a 4v2 with a focus. Oh, dear God. Three hits and a crit into this per jump. I mean, it hasn't done anything too much. There's the focus being spent. And right, so un unbelievably, that goes in as well. So the last shield and a direct hit. So uh, like, I mean, two if in the hole. Right here, you're really not happy with this. That I, I, I said mean, at the start of this a, stream, a, this is not going to take nice. too long. And it's not going to take too long. This game will be over quite quickly. Uh... Did we see a console, console fire roll from Asage? Does Asage have a console fire? Mm -hmm. Ha ha ha. Uh, no, I don't think we did. This is where I hate being a streamer because I, I, should I call a judge for that or not? I never know the answer to this question there. either. It is down to the players to, to know what crits are on. The token's there. But the token is there. It's right in front. As he's looking at the board, it's got a crit. He probably knows it's there. I mean, I know. Have... I'll turn HQ, but I have not commented on or watched the game. But there wasn't this for a problem. Every single game has had a problem like this. Every single one. Yep. Is that it? Because yellow obviously cannot fire. Oh, no, yellow could fire, could she not? Because it wasn't a bump. Uh, yellow was a bump. Yeah. Uh, yeah, they forgot about it. Huh? Yeah, wow. that's, that's not very good, to be fair. That's not very good at all. So there is a shield uh, off Bosk, which I haven't taken down in the overlay yet. Uh so if you can do your little thing and, and see that there should be five hull and a console fire on Asajj and four hull on Dengar and a pretty much untouched Bosk. Or is there a Icelandic or Ukrainian captain in the stream? Would they like to do something about this? Because that is the first thing to do before a judge gets called is ask your captain to do that. It is only a roll of a dice. But uh, the, that dice roll should have been done already. So uh, the blue on two with a wounded pilot, and the other skull is down to two as well. That's the yellow. So with uh, just under forty minutes to go, Iceland lead one hundred to sixty-seven. So you know Ukraine can still certainly half boss gets an R34 and that would actually give them the lead by a point. Yeah, that's going to shoot boss first, which is not going to be very easy. Uh, because he was playing too fast. Yep. So an update from Germany, according to uh, Dodo. Uh, catch lost hand and wedge in the first engagement in his game. Oof. That's... Oh, wow. That's wow, Han and how do you lose Han in the first engagements? Oh, engagements is probably the first two, but uh, that's that's wild. How do you lose Han in the Falcon? I wonder what he's flying against. Anyway, back to this game between Iceland and Ukraine in Group B. I, I, this is becoming a bit of a disaster for um. Iceland actually because where uh, where does where does Icelandic captain is jumping in? Good. Uh, my my concern here is where does Bosk go next to remain relevant? Because he cannot do the three, he'd be off the board. Can can he do the two? Is that is that possible? I mean, he'd, uh, he'd, he's he'd, no choice. He, yeah. He's hard to he's, he's hard to outs. Yeah. Um, he's not clearing. He's going first. 
So, Asajj and Bosch are bumping. Oh yeah. No, absolutely. Asajj, Bosch and Dengar are bumping. This whole thing is being fought in the corner. So if Ukraine takes a couple of deep breaths, relaxes, this is their time to get back in again. Absolutely, and I think Ukraine are completely in this. So uh, this is the system phase. The ZAM card has now been set. You can see that on the left-hand side of the screen on the gigantic uh, ZAM vessel token. So let I'm us... expecting a lot of three banks and three hearts from Ukraine here. Yeah, me too. I mean, you might you could you could 4K or Talon Green. True. In fact, I probably would. I would definitely I, I, 4K and Green. I might do exactly the same thing with Yellow. In fact. It, that's very, I, that rock seemed to be right in the corner. Um, so the 4K that could should fit. They have right? a talent though, right? Uh, do they have a talent? What a very good idea this is. Let me have a quick look at the dial. Um, yeah, they, they, they do. They have three talent. Yep, they do. No, the Fang Fighters have a two talent and a 4K. Yeah. Yeah, the two talent to the left will be is probably a terrible name. Actually, no, I looked at it because you'll still be facing uh, the wrong way. That would be I just really want to get a shot this turn. Like if, I, if, if I'm like if I'm Ukraine, I really want to get an unresponsive shot this yep, turn. absolutely. So they, do, need, they need. They need. They do need that. You can't do this. Like, quite a lot. Yeah. So say I'm watching this on the stream. As opposed to watching this on the board, which means I could actually look at the angles. Uh, yeah, uh, probably doing it on the board. So there's a whole lot of that dice cards there going away on the left hand side from Iceland. So we'll ignore that altogether. So uh, I assume that the captain has told um, Andre that there is that console fire on Assage. So. Captain has done it. So. Our interest is out. Yep. Now, the problem with moving Bosk first is uh, that console fire cannot be flipped down because that's a bump from Assage. And then the. I'm not, I'm not sure if it's Germany, right? Uh, yes, I believe so. Oh, dear. <laughs> he has Jake Farrell left against everybody. Bar, one red squadron. The, oh, oh dear God, that's not good. And I genuinely believe Germany are one of the the, the better teams, uh, in in the entire competition. <laughs> so if you if you don't recognise my co commentator's voice, that he is Connor Holmes from Team Ireland. Uh, at the, every Sunday, him, uh, Liam Baker, and world champion Ollie Pocknell go on to Ollie's Twitch stream. And literally slag every country in the world that isn't England and Ireland. And that's not got... true. We slag Ireland and England too. That is true. That is that the console fire from Massage? That is. That's the wounded pilot. That's the wounded pilot. So I, I'm sure I speared off. Bosch did have to bump. Massage went into the back of him. Yep. Yeah, I think Green misses opportunity here. Big style. Big. Big style. Big time. Um, I assume that. I'm just checking the log on the other other thing here. Yep, it looks like everything is being done. So it's the hard three. Okay, so hard three. I complete this gauge, but yep. Ukraine is not firing. And neither is Iceland. No, that's just uh, I just I, checking the angles on a couple of things, but no, nobody's firing here. No, not with all the bumps. There shouldn't be any valid target there for Dengar and isn't. Um, Assage now rolls so, so far. Okay, so <clears throat> here's how Ukraine gets back into this. Bosk is now relevant for the next god knows how many turns. Uh, Bo Bosk is, is completely, completely dumb. Um, that hit He's going on to Assage dead. has uh, not changed the score one iota. It's already halved anyway oh dear um yeah i i really 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 do not like where where, where he is not one I iota i do not like that I, I, I do not like oh dear dear this is all very very bad indeed okay so sorry i may have been wrong so i might have a long range shot the green through a rock possibly 
I think he does. Possibly. It's a pretty much an elephant shot, but well, better an elephant shot than no shots. I I cannot see Bosk ever firing for the next three turns. In fact, he could be out of the game permanently, which is a disaster when there's I, only I, one shield on him. I never saw. I never saw Sage's arc come up, but that might have been a range three unobstructed shot he's not taking. I don't quite see where we are, yeah. but um, they are now going back to dials. So, so Sage, is Sage brought up his side arc, and we saw that. I don't think he brought up his front arc. I think he's missed that shot. I think he's missed that opportunity. Yep, I would say so. It's not that they failed to activate, he failed to check the arc on the, on the correct gun. So uh, Dodo said he lost it in two to three shooting phases. Three T70s, Rose and Zari just lit him up. Ooh, that's resistance beef. Absolutely one of my favorite lists in this entire game. Did you only play over part shit? Yes. Who am I, who am I, who am I talking about? Never mind. <coughs> <coughs> well, we'll leave it, we'll leave it there, shall we? Let's just, we'll just leave it there. So just over 30 minutes left to go in this Group B game. Uh, Ukraine absolutely in with a chance of winning this. They are only 33 behind. And... I, don't think he's knows, I don't think he knows why. He knows it though. That move with Blues taking him out of any sort of consciousness. He should have fixed the winning pilot. He didn't need to focus. No, he did not need to focus, which is very strange. I, think, I mean, there was no way he would need to focus because Denger can get out. And he knew that because the other two ships had moved. Problem is all so the he time. Himself with a, he sets himself with a stress ship facing the wrong direction. Yep, so no K turns, no talons, no nothing. Um, oh. I assume green will do a hard two because I believe that is blue, right? On the fang. That is a blue maneuver. Oh, if he doesn't, I think I'm going to stop watching. But I'm currently trying to work out how the fuck does Ben, this boss tanker and Sage get out of this? I literally don't know. I, I think one of them may have to go pop pop, to be honest, to kind of give up the room. Uh, and as you can see by the overlay on my screen, Dengar's down to four, and so is Asage. That's not an awful lot of ships, really, to be doing anything with, and that is the points that he's got. It's. Oh, this is, this is, this is rough. I mean, this is rough. So you know, exactly all, all you the two, three, all the twos and the three forward are blue on the fangs. So he can do anything he wants with uh, either of the other two at the bottom of the screen. So but take advantage of the fact now that that they're not moving. Iceland, I, I, Iceland is stuck. Yep, it's it's like they have crunched into Titanic. They are the iceberg that has sunk itself. Not good, and Ukraine has got an amazing ability here to. No, is you seriously have to consider flying Asajj off the board here. Well, it's it, again. If, let's if, let's just look at the points. Asajj uh, has already given up thirty six points. Um, Dengar has given up only thirty one. Asajj is a seventy one point ship compared to Dengar being sixty two. You have to let Bosk out. You have to let Bosk out. You know, no Zan so, shots, no Greedo. The only way to let Bosk out is to, is to drop a Sage off the table, get Dengar cleared this turn. It's a terrible position, but I think he's in real trouble. <laughs> uh, our, our good Ukrainian friend in the chat, uh, Gary Colton. Uh, it says, I think all three are now stuck without flying one off the board. And our Ukrainian friend went, well, if he moves nowhere for more than one turn, I'll call it stalling. <laughs> I'm not sure the Ukrainian <laughs> captain here should be making any such commentary, because this is not going to be positive stalling. Oh, he matches the 4K. Oh, Lord, uh, look at that. Uh, Wonderful. The boss still goes nowhere. Yeah, but Bosk is, Bosk is okay to then, I mean... He doesn't want to sit there and just get repeatedly shot in the back. Uh, no, no, that that would be yeah. intensely bad uh, for many, many reasons. Uh, I'm just checking boss style. You know, Sad's clearing means that that's a three left from Dengar, and that little blue guy is in trouble. Big, big time trouble. So <coughs> let us see where we all end up here. 
you know, Dangar really desperately wants to go left in that jump master. All the other stuff to the right is much more red than uh, white and blue. What kind of maneuver could Dangar be doing here? Because if you go too... a little bit slower, he might bump Dangar. As it stands, there's nothing good to do here. If he doesn't fix wind pilot, it's just going to hold down. He's going to go for the focus boost. Okay, so trying to get out of an arc. Um, like Dengar could do oh. a, a three, a three bank to the left here, and that should clear, um, making some room for Bosk. There is the yeah. too hard. That was the only option open, and I would just stay right there, really. To be honest. No, that's your position. Too focus on hold, but yeah, if Dengar's focus on hold. Out, you're, lo you're losing ship. So there is the focus. Do zero else. That is very clever indeed from the Ukraine. Will we see a boost into the right here from the Fang? Surely to God, yes. I'm trying to get uh, something onto the back. I do. I do. Or the focus and the stress. This now leaves Dengar. And no, if Dengar's, got, if Dengar's called this right, Dengar, uh, Dengar takes the ship. So let us see where this jump goes. And this again is why a fang is not a silencer. If you fix a card with a fang, you do not get the boost after it. Yeah. It makes fixing crits really difficult. Yep. Let us see where uh, Iceland end up with their I6 jump. Oh, they forgot about the console for again. No, it isn't engaged yet. I haven't engaged yet. <laughs> You're getting ahead of yourself. Um, um, and he bumped. Dengar he bumped. bumped. Yep, he bumped. So no shot oh, from wow. Dengar, and uh, the console fire first, please, before the engagement, because Hang cannot. On. Dengar, the hell did Dengar dial in? Too hard left. No idea. Uh, he tried yeah. to do. Let me have a quick look in here. Oh wow! Be great. This is your chance. This... Yep. So the uh, did not oh, go in. Are we going to remember the console fire? Remember the console fire? Uh, <laughs> please remember the console fire. Yeah, thank goodness. So well well done. The players keep it. Oh no. So another. Oh, I think it's making up for the sheer number of aids that I got. Yep, so uh, down to just three. Who's the one who makes this leap very, very dead? Absolutely. So I would assume that you're going to fire at the range two, uh, just to make it a four die green fang instead of going into range three and yellow. So it'll be three v four. Let's just go. Uh, no, it's a two v four. It's a two v four because hard. it's out the side. Indeed, it is. And. Oh. There you go. <laughs> it does genuinely doesn't seem to matter what color the dice are. It's always natties. Um, I got the spend. Well, that's that's some success. Yep. So okay. strip that target, so, but then nothing else uh, because none of the other ships from Iceland can fire at these fangs. But then it's saying that only red, I, uh, red, red, red left a long time ago. Green and yellow. Probably only can fire in. Two. Oh, you bring up, bring up yellow first here. So oh, absolutely. As well, then make your mind up. Absolutely. Don't think I don't think the arc's actually going to fit. To be honest, so it may all have to go in. Yeah, it is only. So this one. Range two right. with focus. It's crit crit if he remembers it, but he doesn't. He doesn't. Because Greedo is Greedo is still active. Yep. A lot of missed triggers in this game, but um. Oh well. Greedo Greedo charges flip down, which it shouldn't be, but. No, it shouldn't Greedo be. Greedo is definitely still active. So the Zam card triggers uh, have been shot here. Uh, gain a charge, all that sort of stuff. I believe your stream might have just fallen off, my friend. I believe it might just have, yes. Well, one of them has, because I'm still on the main one. I've lost the dice cam. 
which is not very good. We've lost the dice cam. You'll never know how many natural evades and natural hits they're going to roll. There's going to be lots. Don't worry. Yeah, we're going to take the anchor here. If you can take the anchor off the board, this game is all but over. Don't think about it, just roll it. There you go. Three hits. So. Uh, three. Uh, two natural events. <laughs> Uh, I am getting completely confused at what the hell is going on altogether now. Uh, this is completely... So yellow fired into Dengar, and Dengar has yet again, yet again, fired of hand, rolled two natural evades on two dice. The lock score from the dice mod at the end will probably be sitting at 28. Absolutely ridiculous. Absolutely madness. Mana, so one more. Um, so that's three damage on Dengar. Dengar starts with six, correct? So she'd be down to just three left. Way less than that, is he not? Is Dengar not? Oh, you're right. I thought he'd take it like considerably more damage than that. No. Nah. Uh, Bosk has still, uh, to the best of my knowledge, only taken uh, one extra shield after all of that uh, malarkey, so down to just one. And Asajj, I cannot see. Can you tell me how many uh, shots that... Um... Asajj is sitting on three hull remaining with a still active console fire. Excellent, because these massive tanks are now getting completely in the way. At least we know Asajj can go four forward. Oh, Absolutely. Which will then give her a side arc shot if needs be. But uh, I, I fear desperately, um, really desperately for Bosk. <laughs> he has just stalled her. Engine will not start. Things are bad. And well, he's going to be there to again. Out, which is, I mean, the fangs are there pulling and bumping the side. And, but, well, I mean, they can just do the two forward. Two four is safe, actually. Two forward is completely safe. But then, going to do the four forward to get out. Asajj needs to get rid of this console fire because the vast majority of damage that's went into her is because that has not been done yet. So, yeah, we're still on dial setting. If there is are. a delay on the stream, uh, the stream seems to have picked up. Which is kind of good. I thought it was my stream then, maybe. Mine's not moving. I don't know. It's still it's up. very possible. It's, it's very still possible. Up. So just under 20 minutes to go. We will keep going anyway because, you know, that's how this is going to roll. I'm going to probably need you as my dice cam has now exited the building. That's fine. I will be a dice cam. And uh, you can be the dice cam, which is awesome. So we'll just get rid of that altogether. Uh, we'll save that and get back to the main screen, which is kind of groovy. So, do you do the four with a sash? Or do you bump into Dengar and try and take a primary weapon shot and try and take one of these fangs off the board. It's been so inconsistent on the fangs that I don't know where they're going. If you, he, did, he did the bump. Yeah, I think that's fair enough, because the fangs do do what I think is the correct move over here, which is just two straight focused on both of them. Yep. Then you're not going to get just removed from the board. Yep. I think Blue should do a two, two still, on to the left and get rid of that. Fire. Get rid of that crit. Do it as a okay. get uh, rid of it. Good man. There we go. Good man. Well played. Enough of that winded pilot malarkey. Still half, but that is not the point. Winded pilot is not this something still you want. Mean this next turn, by the way, Bosk is not moving. Again. Again. There's our two forward. Good man yourself. So remove that stress. Take a focus. Stay right there. Does he have an arc? I think yeah, he does. Yes, he does. So take the focus. Green is completely untouched. There's nothing bad can happen here. There's no consideration. <clears throat> well, Dengar block bumps and still doesn't have arc on you. Nope, absolutely does not. So 
So there's only going to be the one shot coming in beforehand, and that is, as you say, from the Lancer. All right, just double checking they've got their arcs in where they needed to be. But uh, I would completely, completely take the point of Mr. Holmes that if uh, Dengar currently does not have arc, then he does not have arc. I'm not, I'm not, I mean, the dropping focus token on top of his arc means I'm not 100% guaranteed sure that green has it on boss, but I think he does. So yellow does exactly the same thing, takes the focus, and he definitely. Of so, so Gary, Gary tell me the dice cam on the TTS log screen is in the middle, mate. Yes, I'm well aware of that. It's well sorted and well gone. That's how far okay. behind that they are. Let us let us see where we are. And there we Denker, go. Denker K turn. Oh. So we're gonna see how smart I am Ukraine are here. So Dengar shoots into yellow to try and take the ship that's injured off the board. Three yep. and three, perfectly fair. Don't see anything wrong with this at all. But what you don't do is shoot Dagger back. No. That's the current trick. Dagger gets one hit. Dengar takes a hit. He rolls it with his R5P in for hit crit. So we need paint from yellow or he goes away. Oh, he takes some crit. Yes, That's he takes right. his own crits. Which is oh, not... look, it's another console fire. It's There's another no console fire. Forget about that. Perfect, because that's exactly what these guys need, is more more missed triggers. So, there's a console fire on there. Are we down to just one hull left? Does that look no. remotely like it should no, be? Tanker's got two, and oh no, no. He rolls a single evade and takes the crit. The dice have been super unfair today in Ukraine. Oh... And uh, a loose stabilizer. No. Perfect. Alright, so obviously the size is going to try and take yellow off the board. <laughs> well, yes. Yes. Uh, that, that that sounds kind of decent. One hole left, so should be doable at this range. Uh, it is two hits. In fairness, he still has his focus, so an average roll, he's fine. He's just not been rolling particularly well. Uh, he's dead. Unreal. One natural bait, two blanks. And yellow. Yellow goes down. Goes down. Now, what does Yellow do on his way out the door? Still fully armed? Yep, because same take a shot initiative. Into Dengar. Absolutely. Both I4. He take a perfectly safe shot into Dengar. Oh, absolutely, because he's already gone. Because as soon as he shoots, he's off the board. So take it into Dengar. Use your focus. Try and get him off the board. Sounds perfectly reasonable to me. I mean, I'd certainly look up. <coughs> well, either way, there's supposed to be dice rolling. So I've rolled one dice and got one hit. That is the Sage taking yet another console fire hit. Putting a Sage on two. Oh dear God. So two console fires now on a Sage. I mean, that's. Sage, I mean, that, that's. No, Sage is going on. Dengar is going on. But the Sage is taking three hits from that console fire. Oh good God. I mean, it, it, it's. Okay. Yeah, he's going for Dengar. This yeah. is correct, but for the love of God, God, you can roll some dice that fucking matter. Let me see. There you go. That's, he listens. Dengar needs natural evades. Dengar rolls natural evades again. Again. My God. So down to just the one. That's a blinded pilot, which really doesn't do that much, really, when there's just down to one. So let us add that in there. So one away from death on Dengar, uh, two away still on Asajj. Yeah, a really shit choice for a green. Yeah. I used to go on for a... I, mean, uh, I, I think you have to. This king can keep fucking up. I know you don't want to spend this focus. Dengar can't roll natural evades twice, right? I mean, there's just no way to roll there, twice, there's, right? There's no chance. It's impossible. Uh, Dengar rolls natural evades again. Two natural evades. I'm not kidding. He has rolled two natural evades again. Uh, which means Dengar has then survived. No, I think he's dead. I, uh, I think he should no, be dead. Outrageous that he had to spend the focus. Absolutely outrageous that he had to spend the focus. 
So yellow gone. Dengar gone. Uh, Dengar just rolled two hits and a crit on his responding shot at green. Oh dear god. Out of hand. Out of hand. And the response is one of eight. So we're half on green. I don't think I've ever seen a game where dice has been this much of a factor. No. Ever. And the crit on green is another blinded pilot. Seems like it's only console fires and blinded pilots in this game. So uh, there's the blinded on there. The two down here. Dengar now gone. Good grief. I mean, this is just madness. So 11 <coughs> minutes roughly clock to go. If I've got this right, with Dengar being gone, Bosk has only lost two shields, and Asajj down to just two hull. Andre Balvinson from Iceland has scored 150 points. Andre Gorbanov from the Ukraine has still scored 98. So would need 53 to lead. Oh, uh, oh. So... 53, I mean, at this point now, he would need to half uh, Asajjo to give him another 35, which isn't enough. Uh, Bosk is only 34. So two shots in the Asajj to kill, and then an awful lot of shots in the Bosk. It looks like I saw... Okay. Can't, can't this, but this, is, this, this completely ridiculous variance is awe-inspiring. It helps. There is no justice to the screen, guys. There is no justice. He has rolled an insane number of national days. Yeah, absolutely. Absolutely. So the way that we're looking at things right now, I can't really see how Iceland Hulk can lose this game unless um, unless Boss can. flies off the board all by no. himself. And he's not going to do no. that. He can kill Asajj this turn. Which will give him, as I say, another 35 points. Uh, but he needs 52 just for a final salvo. So 53 to win it would be slightly short. No, you, can, you wipe out uh, Asajj and then you just stay behind Bosk and pummel the absolute hell out of him. Oh, and yeah. put on very, very quickly. Absolutely. Especially if anybody remembers a Greedo is not, there is a, you know. There is actually a Greedo. It's just a one off. Yeah. So the wounded, um, now the blinded pilot there on green. Really, is it that much of, a, of an issue when you've only got two hull left? I'm not so sure. Is it blinded or wounded? Uh, on green, it is blinded. He has to, he has to, he has to get rid of it. Yep. It has his firepower. Which is ridiculous. Blue is is literally having a cup of tea at the top of the screen. Absolutely. No, blue, Ab blue, blue is a one hard left boost focus. Absolutely. <clears throat> I'm just wondering whether or not I do the same thing with green and try and go to the back Bosk, but you will not be able to get a Sage if you do that. I don't think there's any way you can get a Sage if Sage is dialed correctly. So uh, uh, pretend you are Ukrainian, sir, and a Sage your dial would be? One forward. Fuck the four forward. Fire. Four forward. Well, with, or with, with or the... one forward, block, bump, bump, bosk again, and then get your shot on the green, which is also perfectly acceptable. Which is also perfectly acceptable. To, to be fair, to, to see... I just think you've got to put console fire. Yeah, with two hull left on a Saj. I mean, the Lancer is such a great ship when you can fly it, right? Except these guys just literally went, hello, how you doing? I'm going to sit here and have a picnic. And that is exactly what's happened, which has given you the Ukraine a chance, a real chance with uh, only, well, about 10 minutes to go, isn't it? Something like that? No, eight minutes to go. Seven, seven minutes. Seven minutes to go. So let's just see where they end up. Ukraine, Ukraine, you're the one that's still rolling the dials here. Speed it up. Yep. That, there's not enough time. You are behind and um, you do not want to be behind you want to be able to get in here as fast as possible uh mr gorbanov turn them over get get this going and there's an awful lot of uh hand moving and deciding what they're at five forward from the south yeah, and yeah, please I tell think, me I think that's right, please that's tell right. me console fire has been taken away 
It has. What a good man he is. Like, Green, I think Green's going to bump into Sage. If he's got it perfect, it's too hard to the right. Let's have a look. And no bumps as well. He's bumping. Three bank right in front of him. Uh, that's not where that green wants to be. Absolutely not where that wants to be at all. Like, being a range one, great, but not when you're facing the wrong way. That's not good at all. Um, no, that's, that's, that's dreadful. That's, that's, a, uh, that's a poor maneuver um, from Ukraine. Because that's going to be a primary shot right out the front. Something you can do. You can't boost that. You can't boost that. I guess there we are. And a one hard boost as expected. So shots. Uh, all at initiative four. This entire remaining ships are all I-4s. But because of the initiative is with Iceland. Um, I don't know. I, I never understand this point where everybody's taking their time. There is one shot on the side. Exactly. It's, that's how it is. So the two Andres need to um, start shooting. You go... Oh, uh, he thinks... Okay, so hold on a second. He thinks that uh, he thinks if he takes the shot, he takes Concordia off green. He's wrong. He is completely wrong. Okay. Uh, so, oh, he's done something. He's done yes, something right, so that's, that, is, that is the ability um, at the front. Uh, so you take a stress... Uh, or you remove your green token to not take the stress. Is going. He's taking the race to a shot. Go for it, sir. Let's see what you get. Well, I get it. He's trying to strip the focus off blue. Oh, absolutely. That's not bad. I think killing the guy would have been considerably easier because I've just done that. But anyway. I, I would really quite like them to be rolling the dice, you know, at the bottom of the screen, <laughs> actually on the map so I can see. No. But. It's fine. Oh, we, have a, we have a okay. live reporter on the other side of the galaxy. We've got a hit eyeball. He's actually going to have to spend a force if he wants to hit. And why not? He's only got... He does not. He does not, though. I agree with that. Yep. Yeah, defensively here. Absolutely. You're getting 3 on 3 back. And you need to call her in. So, blue. I speed this up. 3 on 3. Focus versus a force. Uh, the shot is one crit. One crit. Surely, statistically, because of this ridiculous one ruling. Hit, one eyeball, one blank. There we go. So, no damage done whatsoever at all. Under five minutes to go. I mean, he, need, he, needs, uh, uh, he needs shots. He, he must kill Asajj. Absolutely has to. I would do the 4k uh, from. Green, I would do the three in. Okay. Anything. No, because He's they're stressed. all stressed. Holy... Doing it. And there's Asajj proving her worth. Good play, guys. Eh? Because that is a great changer. The tanks have it. The tanks have it. Be uh, excellent for Ukraine to be able to. Um, I don't see how they can come back, but oh god, I would be furious if I played this game. So in I'm in the sheer number of events. in the other Iceland Ukraine game, I've got some news, and it's good Ukraine news won. for Ukraine because they won. They beat Iceland in the other game, so that's uh, at least one win there for Ukraine. Congratulations on this one. I think it's probably going to be leveled up by the end of this. To be fair, so we're going to have to see where we're at. 150 to 98. Leads by 52. And this, I would assume, the the way that they're playing now uh, and the slowdown that what they're doing. But three minutes ago, this is, may, may even be the last round. There is no need for slowdown here. No. <clears throat> as as there's a three bike left. Yep. Worst case scenario, bumps and does not get shot. Yep. Bosk does a is Bosk too hard right red? Bosk's too hard right is, is. red. Oh, is red. So it's three hard right. Three, three hard, hard right. right. Yep. Fine. Absolutely. Uh, worst Keep case scenario, off. you take a couple of heads, but it's very unlikely you're going to take half. Yeah, no. To, to be fair, he still has a field. So, so whatever. 
And the Asajj death will not give Ukraine the win. So that that's a tad unfortunate for Ukraine. But um, the win for Iceland here will level up if this is the only two games that they have played in... Uh, Three hard right from Bosk. There we go. Clears keep, the rock. Keep that stance. Uh, that's, uh, that's five Ks, which is also not terrible. That's not bad at there all. Are only nightmare, nightmare here is if Green has to pull him forward and doesn't bump any. That's exactly what happened. There we that's go. That's exactly what happened. That is exactly the worst thing that could happen. Ukraine has now got a chance in hell. So... The problem is you can't take a focus. It focus doesn't matter because... Pilot. Yes. But if it hasn't bumped, why does I mean he has to They're counting the damage. I, I don't know what he's doing. I have no idea what is not happening. Just take a defensive. Which is a real shame. Man. But there we go. That that yeah. is that is just how life currently is right now in this game. I'm gonna call it this will be the last turn. This, the Zam card now as well? Because that's important at this point. Uh, that would be very important right now at this point. <sighs> Alright, so you, I, I can only assume Ukraine has conceded the fact this is the last turn. You still take the focus for the return shot. No, absolutely. Why would you not take your your uh, your focus and your action? That would be silly. And by taking take 50, he's, he's pushed it out. He's just cost himself the game. <sighs> so I assume here It'll be a boost to the right to get out of the Sajish uh, line of sight and just in to, or just stay there. But I think Why? I I cannot answer Why? that question. I, I can't answer Why? that question. It doesn't matter what you do anymore. Well, there goes the timer. Uh, this is the last round. Green will not be shooting. Uh, there is a boost to the front there uh, to take a stress and that was a Sage in. Uh, this one was definitely in at range 2 but obstructed. 2 has got uh, Blue has got 2 hull left and a blinded pilot. I'm actually going to pull back and see what it is when they roll them themselves. Here's the roll. Just the one. Oh, Greedo. Greedo. Unbelievably yeah, uses Greedo. 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 <laughs> minutes, so uh, three back. And this will be... Uh... Four greens. I mean, come on. There you go. No, all good. And then the return shot from... Now, will he... Will he, will he take anything here? Because, you know, Zam... Is on that. Well, Zam's going to shoot you back, but 